So by popular demand, I got Lizzie to voice over this week's intro. I've written something quite weird for her to read out. Let's see how it goes. One man, one woman, go face to face, go head to head, go smile to smile. What is this? <laughs> Going. Go forehead to forehead, go back to back, go man to woman. Here comes the text which says build versus. Ah yes, as expected. Hilarious. Make sure to hit that subscribe button if you're new because you get to watch videos of mine and that is fun and stuff. Okay, let's start. Now like usual, before we get into today's episode, we have to announce the winner of last episode. Oh gosh, Lizzie, why are you crying? Because I've lost again, Joel. No, you haven't, Lizzie. You won with 81%. You what? You destroyed me. Yeah, your island. Whoa, your head just... Oh gosh, that was like something out of a horror movie. <laughs> I was just really excited, sorry. Uh, okay, so we all get to see where you're going to put it today, Lizzie. Oh, okay. Right. Good. Anyway. Do you hate it? I, I, I do hate it because look how neat and tidy mine is. And look at this mess. It's like... Maybe one day I'll neaten it up. Maybe one day, but I doubt it. Uh, this is. I think this just goes to show our personalities. You, chaotic. Me, in line. Yeah. I wouldn't describe you as a neat person, Joel. No, but... Why yeah. does this not extend outside of Minecraft and into the home? I don't know. Please don't bring this up again. Not again. <laughs> not the door handle. Not in front of everyone. No. So this week's theme, as voted by you guys in the poll, is shrine slash temple. I'm not sure which one we can build either, basically, Lizzie. Do you know anything about shrines or temples? Have I ever built one before? Yeah. No. Okay, well... Today is a first. I've built shrines and temples before in Crazy Craft, Egg, One Life, oh. everything, really. Well, you're quite an expert then, aren't you? Before we get started, unfortunately, part of Lizzie's recording glitched out, so you may only see a few bits of her building, but don't worry, we still get to see everything at the end. Joel, I've never built a shrine before, I'm scared. I kind of know kind of what I want to do, but at the same time, I don't. Does that make sense? No. Uh. Well, I've made a bold first move. Ah, interesting. I am currently world editing. I presume you are doing the same. Yes, indeed. Aha, uh -huh. lovely. Now the question is, what are you making your shrine to? I don't know yet, Joel. Ah, see, that was the first thing I thought of was, what is this shrine to? I just made the setting for mine first. Oh, interesting. Would it be wrong to make it... Hmm. To make it what? Hmm... Hmm. I don't know what to build it out of. How big is it going to be? Is the full thing going to be a shrine? Is it I don't certain... know, Joel! Oh, yes, very nice, very nice. You know what? It's been a long time since I used chisel and bits. I think it's about time I used it again. No, not the chisel and bits. Yes, the chisel and bits. I'm just making a shape of mine first. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm doing as well. Like, I'm just sort of... There's a style I'm going for. I'll just say that. I wonder if it'll be a similar style to yours. Probably not, because I've probably gone for the most boring kind of temple. Boring temple? But no temple. Yeah, mine's a boring, boring temple. Hmm. Is it themed around any culture? Mm, kind of. Ah, that's interesting. That's much better. After you see this, you're going to divorce me and marry someone who's better at Minecraft building. Oh, no. Is it not going yeah. well? No, Joel. Why, what, what's bad about it? It's ugly. You say this every time though, and it's always something that ends up being really nice. I'm pretty sure you said that about your island last time and then it looked really good. What is a color that complements sandstone? Is the answer none? None, yeah. Maybe <laughs> orange or like, yeah, orange? That's pretty basic though. There isn't really one. Yeah, I'm realizing that now. If you change it to endstone, then purple goes well with that. Now, I want to keep it sandstone. Oh, that's that color. That's a nice color. Is it orangey? <laughs> oh my god. What's it's a compact raw pork chop. Wait, what? Ew. Oh, Wait. that is a nice color though. Wait, how do you know? Because oh. I looked up compact raw Look, pork. Look, put it down and break it. Oh my gosh. It's perfect. Wait, does it make that noise when you walk on it? Oh, it does. Oh, it's perfect. Okay, well that settled it for me. Oh, I know what would go nice with it. Found some cool blocks. Oh, what blocks are they? Oh, you're not like, gonna tell me. Well, no, I'm not gonna tell you. Oh, shouldn't have said that. You were just about to tell <laughs> I was me. about to. Are they void stone? It's void stone in it. I knew it was void stone. No. Is it more, it's like raw beef blocks or something like that. I reckon purple would go nice with this. Purple and gold. It's kind of hideous. About black and gold. Black and gold. Oh no, it looks like a face. What the heck? Face? 
Yeah, I accidentally made a little like a booth. I realised why I'd stopped building stuff with chisel and bits. It, it's it's very fiddly. It takes forever, doesn't it? Yeah, this is so bad. I'm gonna scrap it. I hate this. This is so stupid. I actually quite like this blue colour. How is your build coming along, Lizzie? It's very blue, Joel. Very that might blue. be a problem. Why? Why blue? I don't know, choice. Joel. Well, it would look funky. Does it look funky? In the way, in such a way that it looks ugly, yeah. Oh no. I feel like our temples are probably going to be the opposite. Right, what have you gone for then? Is yours like blue and... I, yeah, I mine's... I, I'm not sure why I've gone for this colour theme, but I've gone for it. So that's all I'm going to say. Okay. It's kind of working, a bit weird, but it it's <laughs> looking like a shrine, kind of. I guess maybe. I'm trying to make something that looks like a good small tree in right. a in a plant pot, but it's hard. I've only done the outside of mine so far. Is that going to be an issue? No, because I haven't even finished the outside of mine yet. So you're probably <laughs> ahead of me. I am very much panicking that this is take going to take way too long, and I I I I like I said, panicking. I see. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, mine's kind of slow too. There's no trident. We're in 1.12. Ugh. Why do you want a trident? Acceptable. Why do you need to give this guy a blooming katana? Wait, there are no ice stairs. Ice stairs? What are you on about? There are no ice stairs. You can make your own if you want with uh, chiseling bits. Oh uh, yeah, that's no fun. I find it fun. I find it. Tedious. I think I've messed this one up this week. I had this idea in my head, but to be honest, I've not pulled it off. I've spent way too long <laughs> fiddling with chisel and bits, and I could have built something way better, way cooler, in less time without chisel and bits, but no. You done goofed! It's so fiddly, I hate it. Why did I do this, Lizzie? Lizzie, why did I, I do this? I told you, it's always a bad idea. I Never know. use chisel and bits. Oh. Man, it looks okay, but honestly, it's just not worth how long. And it also looks like way too... Hmm, I might have to lower it all. Now that I've actually got the main building done, I can actually start working on stuff that's actually fun without chiseling bits. It's yeah. so much more relaxing. Yeah. <laughs> I'm happy for you. <laughs> okay. How's yours going? Pretty well, just adding in some, some, well, I would say greenery, but it's not green, but trees. Adding in some trees. Make it's it not nice. green. Hmm, interesting, isn't it? wonder what it could be, Lizzie. I don't know. Find out shortly, I guess. How's yours going? You coming along goodly? Goodly? Bit weird, that? honestly. It's a bit weird. Oh, you gone for a weird shrine. Interesting. As always. Yeah, that's the quirkiness that wins it for you. But when I go weird, I go too weird, to be honest, most of the time. Well, I went weird last time with the floating horses and... Uh... <laughs> I don't think it was the floating horses that lost it. I think it I think, is. Everyone I think you like, lost it. No, I'm pretty sure everyone was like, this was a winner. But then Joel went and added in the floating horses and that just ruined it for them. So I'm going to keep adding floating horses if I want to. Although there'll be no floating horses on this build. Or will there? I don't know. Maybe it's a shrine to the floating horses from the last island. Is there a salt block? Um, yeah, I think so. I can't see it. Uh, maybe not, actually. If there was, I'd be using it all the time because I'm really salty. I see. Yeah, exactly. Okay, I think I'm pretty much ready to decorate the insides <gasps> now. Oh. Not finished yet, don't worry. Okay, I've, mine's starting to get weird now. Should I be worried? Maybe a little, actually, after you look at this. You might not want to be married to me anymore. Okay, now I'm worried. Oh, I hope this looks good. I think I might be done. Okay, I'm almost done. Nice. Okay. All right, so we are done building, and we actually looked at mine first last week, Lizzie. So today we're going to look at yours first. I'm very excited to see your shrine. Would you like to lead the way? Yes, okay, so come with me and you'll be... In a desert. Of pure imagination. <gasps> oh my gosh. It's a desert temple in its prime. It's not abandoned wow. like the other ones. So it's got a nice little water feature here. And wow. oh, there's a wandering trader out ah. here and everything. Hello. That's cool. I like that. It looks awesome. What the heck? I like the blue. The blue goes really well with the sandstone. Good yeah, job. so as you can see, yeah, it's it's not been destroyed. It's no longer a ruin. We even have the little statues up here of the guardians of the temple. Oh my gosh, yeah, look at them. What the heck? They've got like cool... Oh, that's cool. I like that a lot. Very nice, very nice. So maybe we should go inside. Oh, do, do you want to lead the way? I'm kind of scared, to be honest. Yeah, okay. So in here, oh um, we have the four oh. gods of Minecraft. Oh, wow. This is crazy. This looks awesome. Oh, I love that. I love the village head. That looks so cool. Oh, my gosh. All right. What, what, what are the four gods? What's this one over oh, yeah. here? So this first one, this is the god of sun. 
So we must make offerings to him in oh. order for the day to come. Okay, so he's the do daylight cycle, I guess. Yeah, he's in charge of da the daylight cycle. Ah, okay, what about the Next blue one? Next is the god of water, so oh. you can make your fishing offerings to him in order to get look of the sea. Ah, okay, and he's got some puffer fish and some other fish. He's, he must have dropped his fish as well. Normally, it's just you drop your fish. No, it's an offering. It's a shrine, Joel. Oh, okay, Joel. sorry, sorry. A shrine, of course. Yeah, well, that is the thing. on purpose. Yeah, yeah. Uh, next, we have the Earth God. Oh, I um, like He's him. in charge of all things that grow. Oh, so flowers, you make flower offerings to this guy. And then finally, we have the God of Death. Oh, If oh. you want to respawn, you must pray to the God of Death. Okay, wow, that's kind of scary. Oh, I like the sparkles on this thing. This looks cool. That's kind of all quite creepy, though. I'm not sure about And you the can God offer him a totem of undying. Ah, oh, yeah, on the floor, of course. Right, well, yeah, I, I, I think my favorite is the God of Earth, to be honest. I really like him. Well, you, there are no favourites. You can't have a favourite because uh, you still need to respawn and you still need to fish and you still need the sun. So you're not allowed to have a favourite god. None of these worshippers have a favourite god. Okay. Why? Who are these worshippers? What is this guy? He's he's a guardian of the okay. temple. And then everyone else is just, you know, villager worshippers. Because like I said, this temple is in its prime. It's not a ruin like others. Okay. Interesting. Well, awesome. I love the temple. Looks very cool. I like the theme you've gone for. Um, I've gone for a slightly different theme. Uh, I thought you might. Yeah, so if you want to follow me i kind of went along the shrine uh sort of area so we've gone for a very sort of asian oh it's very pink yeah i went for wow a pink it looks shrine. like we built the opposite thing i know i would have expected me to build what you've built and i expect you to build what i've built yeah if you'd like to head to uh the shrine You'll see there's a sign above it, Lizzie. What does it say? The Shrine of Lizzie. Yes, that's right, Lizzie. It's your shrine. It's a shrine to you. We appreciate our queen. Look, there's you in a gif. You're moving. Joel, I don't like this. Lizzie, it's okay. Come over here. Come have a look. Joel, I'm scared. This here, Lizzie. This is... What does it say? The lavender is taken from Lizzie's area on one life. Yes. What's it called, Joel? The area? Mm-hmm. The lavender fields? What? What's it called? Lizzie, hello? You there? Lizzie? Oh gosh, she just did a full 360 head turn and she's shaking that head. What, what, what's it's it Lavender Land! Lavender Land, sorry, sorry, sorry. But over here, what's this? The original walrus hat of, of, of peace from Crazy Craft. It's a bit big for my head. Uh, yeah, I don't well, remember my head being this big during well, Crazy Craft. During Crazy Craft, your head was actually twice as big as it is now. Oh, um, I see, it's shrunk now, I'm yeah, a pea head now. Yeah, you're a little pea head now, but you used to be like melon, absolute melon of a head. Uh, but yeah, you've been taking doing a head diet. I don't know what I'm saying. Uh, over here, what's a cow this? Cow from Moo Moo Meadows. Yeah, look at that. Oh, it's a Jeremy cow. Yeah, of course. straight from Moo Moo Meadows. And this. Oh, oh, what's this? Oh, maybe we should have just gone past this one. <laughs> Joel, why are what? my toenails pink? Because <laughs> you painted them. Oh, okay. I see. Um, this yes. is what. What does it say? Strand on the left, a strand of her beautiful pink hair. On yep. the right, a couple of her precious toenails. How did you get my toenails without me noticing? Oh, I snuck over while you were building your temple. So, um, yeah. One of the original pet gravestones from Shadowcraft kept in mint condition. Yeah. Lovely. Yeah, there you go. So, I started off really looking quite nice, you know. You, you seem to be walking away from the shrine. What, what are you doing? Just getting a good look. Trying to take it all in. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. You Definitely to... not trying to escape from you. Okay, well, I, I, I was quite happy with how the shrine looked. And I knew it was going to be a shrine to you, and then it just kind of got a bit creepy at one point. But it looks pretty, doesn't it? It it looks beautiful, Joel. Thank I'm you. very flattered. Why why you just you keep flying away from me, Lizzie? I'm trying to get close to you so I can Lizzie. Can you come back, please, Lizzie? Uh, this way. We need to do the outro, Lizzie. We need to do the outro, Lizzie. Stop, Lizzie. Tr the outro. Please come back, Lizzie. You're gone. Oh gosh, you disappeared. Unlucky for you. I am opt. Hello. No! So that's going to be it for this episode of Build Versus. I hope you did enjoy. Um, if you want to vote for who's winning, then there's a community poll. I'll put a link right now in the description. And you'll also be able to find it by going to my YouTube channel and then going on my community page and it'll be right there. If you want to vote for me, I'm on the left with my shrine to Lizzie. And on the right, we have Lizzie's Shrine of Minecraft, the original desert temple. Thank you so much for watching this video. Hopefully we haven't weirded Lizzie out too much and she'll come back for next episode. But we shall see. Uh, I'll see you another time. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.